WNBA legend Diana Taurasi of the Phoenix Mercury weighed in on the controversy surrounding Caitlin Clark's omission from the Team USA women's basketball roster for the upcoming 2024 Olympics in Paris. Taurasi, known for her straightforward approach, provided insight into the complexities of selecting a national team. Whenever you're trying to cut down to 12 players from this amazing pool of players, there's always going to be controversy. There's always going to be names like, how does that person not make it? You know, I think you see that with all-star teams and, you know, the Olympic team is really just a collection of the best players, Tarasi said, as reported by Yahoo Sports, via Clutch Points. Tarasi, who turned 42 Tuesday and will appear in her sixth Olympics in Paris, emphasized the importance of team chemistry over individual talent, a critical factor often overlooked by the public. At the end of the day, Team USA basketball has always had a firm grasp of what they need as a team. I think people kind of lose track of, no matter, you have to make sure that 12 players fit to form the best team, not necessarily the best players, Tarasi said. You know, whatever the 12 are, I think USA Basketball has done a great job of putting that collection of talent together. The official roster, revealed Tuesday, is composed of the Minnesota Lynx's Nafisa Collier, the Seattle Storm's Jewel Lloyd, the Connecticut Sun's Alyssa Thomas, the New York Liberty's Sabrina Ionescu and Brianna Stewart, the Las Vegas Aces' Chelsea Gray, Kelsey Plum, Aya Wilson and Jackie Young, and the Mercury's Kalia Copper, Brittany Griner and, of course, Tarasi. Clark, a standout rookie for the Indiana Fever, recently scored a career-high 30 points against the Washington Mystics June 7th, leading her team to a narrow 85-83 victory. She was also named May's Rookie of the Month by the WNBA. Despite this, her exclusion from the Olympic team has sparked widespread debate within the sports community. Clark's response to it all, however, was nothing short of graceful. Honestly, no disappointment. I think it just gives you something to work for. That's a dream. Hopefully one day I can be there, Clark said previously. She also expressed her support for the team, adding, I'm excited for the girls who are on the team. I know it's the most competitive team in the world, and I know it could have gone either way. The decision by the Olympic Committee to inform Clark ahead of the public announcement was appreciated by the young star. They called me and let me know before everything came out which was really respectful of them, and I appreciated that, Clark said. However, Clark's coach, Christy Sides, hinted at a different side of Clark's reaction. Sides recalled Clark texting her, Hey coach, they woke a monster, suggesting newfound motivation in the wake of the decision. Clark's rookie season has already been historic, driving unprecedented attention to the WNBA. The league has seen record-breaking attendance and television ratings largely attributed to Clark's electrifying play and competitive spirit.